This holiday season, some students at Chatham Elementary School are making sure that other kids feel loved and supported as they go through cancer treatment. Now, the kids from Chatham recently sent their homemade gifts special delivery to the Jimmy Fund Clinic at Dana-Farber Cancer Institute. And that's where I met the third grader who led the charge on a project that is close to her heart. You do the voice Hattie Beerworth represents a school full of elves. There are Christmas colors, as you can see. We're hoping to make the holidays brighter for kids with cancer. I think it will make them feel really happy knowing that out there these kids love them and are thinking of them. What got Hattie thinking was a fundraising letter her family received from a boy named Max. And it was about how he had cancer and how he was scared, but he kind of um, transformed that scaredness and worry into hope. And that's what I want to try to do, too. So, with help from Chatham Elementary's Kindness Club, Hattie spearheaded a school-wide effort to make friendship bracelets. I probably skipped, like, two days worth of recess to do it. That's Hattie's proud older sister, Jane. Some people do need help, and I think it's a really good thing for my sister to do. Seventy bracelets later, the students celebrated with a kindness assembly and mailed their colorful homemade gifts to the kids at Dana-Farber. Now, Hattie Beerworth has never been inside the Jimmy Fund Clinic, but she has seen firsthand the difference that an act of kindness can make for someone fighting cancer. My mom had cancer twice, one stomach cancer and then both types of breast cancer. So that was really challenging for our family. A challenge now in the past. Lindsay Beerworth is cancer free and aiming to set an example for Hattie and Jane by living with gratitude. It was the girl's idea to pay it forward. They completely have taken initiative on their own, right? It wasn't like mom and dad prompted, oh, you should go do this. So yeah, it's, uh, it's pretty cool. The bracelets are a home run. These are so great. I've already given out a few to the kids and they love them. Lisa Sherber is Dana Farber's Director of Patient and Family Programs. The girls gave her a small collection the family took up at home. We now want to make kids feel happy and supported and loved. And the last few bracelets. What's been the reaction of the kids who've received the bracelets? To know like kids their own age or maybe some of the younger kids, they know that older kids are thinking of them. That just gives them hope and strength and everything, everything magical. A gift that says you're not alone. And I feel like that would be really nice because sometimes the smallest things count as the largest thing ever. Mm. It probably feels like a big thing if you're a child at the Jimmy Fund Clinic. Hattie says she remembers when her mom got love from other families, that it made her feel better too, and that all of the students and the teachers at Chatham Elementary are hoping that the families of the young patients at the Jimmy Fund can feel how much they care. Yeah. Hattie is deep. Oh, I'm telling you, she wise beyond her eight years and unstoppable. Yeah.